Today is the day Minecraft 1.21 just came out and you want to download it. Well, if you've already got the Minecraft launcher here, make sure you've selected Minecraft Java on the left hand side and then come under latest release, select it and click play and it will open. Now, I do want to mention that if you want to play Minecraft 1.21 in the future, you can also create a new installation here. I'm going to name that simplegamehosting.com. More on that later, but it's the best way to play Minecraft with your friends. And then go ahead and click the versions drop down box here and search for release 1.21. Uh, you can also actually search for it and you'll see all the pre releases and everything. But right here it is. And then you can go ahead and create that and play Minecraft using it by clicking play here. Now, if you don't have the Minecraft launcher, you're going to need that, right? Because the Minecraft launcher is what makes all of this happen. Well, in the description down below, we have a link here, which is where you can get the Minecraft launcher. Now, there's kind of two ways to get it, though. One is using the Microsoft Store. So if we go and search up the Microsoft Store on our computer, it'll be installed if you have a Windows computer. And then all you'll want to do is search for Minecraft. Now, here you're going to see a bunch of different stuff. You want to install this, the Minecraft launcher right here and you can go ahead and get that installed and play Minecraft using this. For example, if I hit play, it would open up the Minecraft launcher here. Now, another way to get it, and this is what I recommend if you have Game Pass, is by using the Xbox app. So if we go ahead and open up the Xbox app here, what we want to do is search for up here at the top, Minecraft Launcher. And then when you search that, just like in Windows or the Microsoft Store, right there it is, Minecraft Launcher. You can go ahead and install it, and I can actually launch it from here as well. So tons of different ways to get the Minecraft Launcher, but you're going to need the Minecraft Launcher in order to play Minecraft 1.21. And then whenever you get it installed and you're good to go, you can go ahead and log in. You'll need to log in using your Microsoft account that either you play Xbox with if you're using Game Pass, or if you've purchased Minecraft with a Microsoft account, you will log into that Microsoft account. And then from there, you can go ahead and click Minecraft Java Edition. You'll be on the home page by default. Make sure that 1.21 is selected here on the latest release and then click play. Now for those of you on Bedrock Edition, I do want to mention that as well, but before we do, have a message from our company, Simple Game Hosting. Go to the first link in the description down below to break down the XYZ slash SGH to start a Minecraft server in just a few minutes and start playing Minecraft 1.21 with your friends. In my opinion, the best way to enjoy the Minecraft 1.21 update, specifically Trial Chambers, is with your friends, so go get a server at Simple Game Hosting and play Minecraft 1.21 with your friends. Plus, when it's time to change things up, you can easily add mods to your server, plus into your server or install mod packs on your server with our easy one click mod pack installer. So go ahead and go start your server the simple way at the first link in the description down below to break down to XYZ slash SGH and start playing Minecraft with your friends. Now for those on Minecraft without our condition, it's the same thing. You should just be able to click this drop down box here, make sure the latest release is selected, click play and it'll work. Literally just click play and you're good to go. However, sometimes it won't update automatically as quick as Java Edition and you can't get specific version controls like you can on Java Edition. So how do we fix that? How do we make that happen? Well, it's actually really easy. First, you want to go to the Xbox app here and make sure that it's updated. This can be done by in the Xbox app, right clicking on it, clicking on manage, and then clicking on files, and then check for updates. If there are updates, it will download those, get those installed, and you're good to go. You also may need to update via the Microsoft Store. Like I said, everyone's got the Microsoft Store for they have a Windows computer, and in here you can actually update things. This can be done by coming down here to library and then in your library there's a get updates button and when you click get updates it's going to download updates for all the stuff on your computer including Minecraft if it's not updated. So that's kind of everything you need to know to update to Minecraft 1.21 Java Edition. Once you've got that you can go ahead and update it or and Bedrock Edition I should say because that was Bedrock second and then Java was first but then once you've got it all you got to do is select it in the launcher and click play. Once we've clicked play on that 1.21 edition it will open up and you can start enjoying all the amazing features that Minecraft 1.21 has such as trial chambers and you know the new mobs, the breeze, the bog, the crafter block. It's kind of crazy. What are you most excited about? Let us know in the comments and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.